Hi, I'm Auri Katarina, and this time I'm in Switzerland. This is probably the dirtiest home in Europe. I've never seen anything so amazing. Even though the story of this home is heartbreaking, and I will tell you that in a minute. Up until this point I have only cleaned houses in Finland, and that's why I want to thank Scrap Daddy for enabling this trip and me to help this girl in Switzerland. Scrap Daddy sponsored me plane tickets and hotels, so my boyfriend and I could go help this miserable girl. This house owner was a young girl in her mid-twenties. Her childhood was normal, she went to school and had a career. In 2014 she got fired and that's where the downhill started. She got severely depressed. She was living in this apartment and day by day as her depression got worse, so did the apartment. She had to keep it a secret for all these years. Not even her closest family members knew what was going on. It was so sad. She didn't have that many friends either and the few ones never visited her. And every time when someone did want to come over, this girl had to come up with excuses so no one would know the truth. She lived in this apartment for five years and slept in her bed and washed herself in the shower whenever she had the strength to. Some of my followers wanted to know if she was bothered by the smell, but she said that it was just the new normal for her and she just got used to it. Throughout the years she got more and more ashamed of her situation and eventually she didn't even have the strength to shower. She had to cut all of her hair off so she wouldn't have to wash them. She got to a point when she had to be hospitalized and that's when she told her mother and other relatives about her situation. Her mom couldn't understand her at all and called her lazy. But this girl said that oftentimes people don't understand and you just have to accept that. She hopes that this video helps people understand a little better that that's all anyone in this situation needs. Some compassion. When the apartment became unlivable, she moved to her brother's house and started to get her life together piece by piece. She even found a new apartment. But she was still desperate about this apartment, because having it clean would have cost her over $13,000. She had seen some of my videos on YouTube and realized that she is not alone, that other people suffer from the same problem as well. She decided to put her ashamed aside and work up to courage to ask for my help. She sent me some pictures of her place along with her story and I just knew I had to help her. This brown stuff was dirt. 
the shower drain was clogged so the water would just stand in the shower and overflow on the bathroom floor. The dirt glued onto the walls layer by layer, year after year. I believe that the water had flown all the way to the living room because the clothes on the living room floor had turned into mush and got stuck to the floor tiles. That's why I had to clean this shower in a special way because I couldn't rinse it. This shower cleaning took me many hours, cause the dirt was so stuck in there. But I loved every minute of it. <laughs> This room was full of trashes and I couldn't wait to clean it.
There was a lot of pizza boxes, trashes, shoes, jewelry, wigs, everything. We had to sort all the things. When I was collecting these trashes, my back hurt so much. It was kind of painful, but at the same time so satisfying, so... <laughs> There were so many spiders under these trashes, but I didn't mind anymore. <laughs> we went to buy new trash bag rolls again and again. This house owner and her brother had to take the trashes to the landfill with a tractor two times because I think we collected like 100 bags of trash. In Switzerland trash bags are super expensive and you can only use certain kinds of trash bags on certain areas. For example in some areas you can only use yellow bags. My boyfriend was dissatisfied after my cleaning and fixed the situation. <laughs> he is better than me. This pink spray bottle I have always dish soap and water. I think these black marks had came from the spiders and other insects. This house owner was so sweet and kind, just a normal person. We hugged when we see each other for the first and the last time. When the apartment was ready, she cried and gave us a letter and a gift. Dear Auri and Sami, thank you so much million times. God bless you always. Thank you for helping us people. You guys saved my life. Forever gonna be thankful. My sponsor Nurclean also wanted to help this girl and they gave me a lot of useful supplies to give to her for a fresh start. Scrub Daddy is a company about cleaning and smiles. This is what they said. We were more than happy to sponsor this trip for a, such a great cause. We truly hope that cleaning this home brought the owner endless smiles because at the end of the day, that is what our company is about. This cleaning has been the best one so far. I can't even describe how happy I was there when I was cleaning. It was exhausting but so satisfying at the same time. And I know we saved this girl from a big bill and hope she had a new fresh start for her life. <laughs>